Hello there friends and welcome back to the channel. If you're new around these parts, hello. Thank you so, so much for clicking. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing my August kit lineup with you guys. I have, of course, a million foil options to choose from, lots of game time decisions to be made, but I want to share them all with you. Also, I realize that my kit lineups are a little bit longer than everyone else's and I don't know, well, most other planners, I'll say not everyone. And I don't know if it's because I talk too much probable or if it's because I have too many foil options and can't make a decision also probable but hopefully you guys don't mind so let's get started with the week of July 31st this was in my July kit lineup but technically it's really August there's only one one day from July in there so I thought I'd show you guys again because I'm that stinking excited it was in my July kit lineup because I was too excited this is diamonds for breakfast and this is the week I'm going to see Giselle in concert y'all Giselle Giselle Ooh, I'm so close oh my god I'm so close you guys I'm so close by the time you guys see this it might be the day that I'm going to see Giselle it's either the day I'm going to see her or it's a few days after I've seen her so like I have been changed <laughs> I have been changed anyways i'm sorry i'm gonna calm down um so we're using diamonds for breakfast because i think it gives total renaissance vibes i think both colorways give it like come on i mean if this girl does not give you renaissance vibes i don't know what does homie like uh and this art is just so dang good let me put this down because i have all the extras here oh sorry we have the full box add-on and we have the skin tone, the girl, and the extra full box. So I got all the extras for this one because you know I want to go all the way out, the 15 millimeter. This was all a freebie. Maggie is too good to me. I love that it has a little like um, blow dryer and all the like skin stuff to get you all dolled up, which is exactly how I'm going to feel because it's an event. It's an experience. We have the solids, the patterns, the glitter header page. I'm just, you guys, I, I can't wait. <laughs> I can't wait. Uh, I can't wait. Deco. And, and, oh, I don't want to jinx it. I'm going to whisper it because I don't want to jinx it, but I was looking at the weather, you guys, and it looks like it's going to be fantastic for that day. But I don't want to say it too loud because I don't want to jinx it. Okay, I'm sorry. Back to normal. So <laughs> for foil, you guys, you're getting a silly, silly me today. I'm so sorry. For foil, I am doing a hollow, sparkly hollow condom moment. I have lots of options as per usual, but we have the like disco dancing bottom washi overlay, which I think is so perfect. So, so dang perfect for Renaissance from Kristen's Planner Co. And then I got the disco ball bougie boxes again. So, so perfect for Renaissance. If you guys have heard it or seen any of the aesthetics around it, you know that it is just perfection. I have some special full boxes here, but I'm going to go over the foil bundle. It is the hollow, sparkly hollow foil bundle from SPC, and I think it's just going to be a mood and a vibe. Got your full box header overlays, your two bougie, your scripts and icons page, and then your bottom washi page. You guys, like this spread, this spread is going to be everything like i'm so excited this in my birthday spread i'm just so stinking excited for i have not even laid down the basis for them i'm going to wait for the weeks to pass just in case i need extenders and such since they're probably going to be busier weeks i think um so i am going to wait for them to pass but i just oh, i just can't wait i can't wait um okay so we have the am i missing a... maybe it's in here <gasps> where is oh no y'all i must have left it in the sleeve hang on hold for further traffic clearance all right y'all i almost cried because i thought i <laughs> misplaced my custom quotes from alicia craft which i'm so excited about so i had to make sure i had them okay then i have marche's freebie from Kristen's planner because my girl came through with this 
fantastic Beyonce quote and just this stroke box is going to be perfect and then I got some more customs um, both of them are Beyonce quotes and then we have Renaissance Tour 2023 and Beyonce actually this was not custom this is the Queen Bee overlays I don't know if they're still in shop I assume they are <gasps> so good I can't wait oh I can't wait for the spread I can't wait and then these are some more customs ignore the Epcot ones <laughs> the two here on the um, right are the Beyonce one. So Thick and Slay, and I have two of these. I don't, I don't know if I ordered two of these or if she just threw in two of these, but they're all going in the mix because ugh, it's just gonna be so fun. And then finally, I have my two cust custom quote boxes from Alicia Craft, like this Hive one. I, I just, I'm so excited. Like it's so good, you guys. And then I have the Renaissance World Tour one, which I would have, I, I got these before I got this one, which obviously basically says the same thing, but I kind of like the world tour better. So I think I'm gonna use this one. So that is it for the week of July 31st. If you, I forgot to mention, if you order anything from Alicia Craft, you can use my code Anna15 to save on your order because I do PR for Alicia's shop and you can get custom quote boxes like these. You can get custom multis, which are new in shop. She's got new fonts, new scripts, of course, new foil collections. She's just doing everything over there and I'm just so excited for her and to be to be PRing for her honestly so that is the week of July 31st moving on to the week of August 7th all right y'all I don't know how commit how committed I am to anything and of course I have an honorable mention so here's what I have so far for August 7th and it is Seaside Serenity from Liner Designs and you guys like it's just so dang cute. Like I haven't done the beach at all this summer and I feel like we might do it this week. We'll, we'll see. I feel like we might do it this week though because I haven't gone at all and I do really love being near the water. The reason I don't go to the beach a lot around here is because the water is freezing y'all. For those of you who live in the Northeast, you probably know the water is cold. <laughs> and I ain't trying to go into cold water. And people still do. I mean, it's hot. I get it. The water's cool, but it's it's cold. It's not cool. It's cold, in my humblest of opinions. But um, I really, really love this kit. I love it. Just puts me right back to that tranquil kind of vibe with like the books and like this little book cart is super cute. I just love it, and I'm trying to fit in as much summer as I can because there was so much good summer art. So we've got the full boxes. If I do use this, this will be the first time I'm using a kit from Lunar Designs. I have plenty, but I haven't used any of them yet. So that's exciting in itself, but we got the full boxes. I love, 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 love this box so much. I love this artist so much, by the way, too. Um, you have your bottom washi and your date covers. You have your patterned labels your solid labels, your glitter header page, your square boxes, some deco habit trackers. You have some extra boxes here and some more labels, um, sidebar goodies, movie marquees, and then you have your little thing page there. So that is Seaside Serenity from Lunar Designs. I'm so sorry if you guys hear my phone go off. I have, of course, a couple options for foil. So I have the Beach Please underlays in, I'm pretty sure this is light pink from Planet Hannah. And I think it's a pretty good match to the pink in the kit. So I think it might be cool to bring in a little bit of that. Thinking of pairing this with the um, Shimmer Gold Champagne Lights foil bundle from Skull Prince Co. You guys have probably seen it countless times so I'll flip through it real quick but we'll see because I kind of want to do both and I'm not sure how the gold and the pink will look together so you guys let me know what you think but I feel like it's a good opportunity to use up that foil which I'm trying to use what I got and not ordering more uh, let me stick this in the cello um, but that's what I'm planning to do for the week of August 7th Moving on to the week of August 14th, is that what Yeah, August 14th, you guys have seen this already. I think I put it maybe in my June kit lineup. I think it was in my June kit lineup and it got bumped out because again, so much summer art, but this is the May 2023 mystery. I think it's called Friendcation, which I just absolutely love. And I love the sunset -y vibes. You guys will see I have another sunset kit I'm looking at, but you know, decisions, decisions. Um, but I love, y'all know, 
Y'all know how I feel about Pink Diamond Planner Co. kits. I will spare you. We have the deco page, solids and patterns. I love this box. I think it's so cute. I also love this box. Super, super cute. It would be nice to save for a friendcation, but I'm not sure when I'm going on a friendcation. So solids, patterns, maybe next year. And my friendcation would be with my gay best friend. So <laughs> I don't think I'd have any other friendcations. Like a girl's friendcation, probably not happening. But anyways. Uh, we have the, the outfit flat lay, bottom washi day covers, the fashion girls, the fashion girls, and like this braid, this braid. You have the doodles and the extra labels, and then you have the extra color, which I also am kind of obsessed with, so I don't know what I'm going to do there. But for foil, I don't think when I showed this to you guys before I had this foil in yet, but I have it now. So I want to show you the vibes and it is the autumn tie dye. I just got a bunch of autumn tie dye from Planet Hannah. So I have the mixed kind of full box overlays here, two pages of those and the autumn tie dye. Then I have the beach please and the autumn tie dye. And I think it's just going to be so gorgeous with this kit. I cannot. And then we have the bottom washies. I'm, oh, I'm like, what is this in? Shine. <laughs> Literally, it's right there, Anna. Shine. And then we have the sunny bottom washi set. So that is what I'm thinking. I realize I don't think that I have headers. I'm not too bummed about that because I don't really care all that much about the headers. So there is that. I also have, which I do think I showed this one, so I'll flip through it really quick, but I have this like very old shimmer, almost like gold coppery foil bundle. I don't even remember what this came with, um, but it's super old and I just thought the color was so perfect for the like gold in the kit. So we have the full box overlays. This is when it was just one page, the bottom washi header overlays. Scripts, icons, date dots page, and then two pages of the bougie. So that is for the week of August 14th. Okay, so for the week of August 21st, I have another sunset -y type kit. Again, trying to squeeze in as much summer as possible. So it may change a little bit because I realize I have a lot of beach stuff. But July didn't have as many summer kits. I had more, you know, I had birthday and then B. So it ended up taking away for some of the time it would be used for summer kits. So I'm trying to squeeze in as many as possible, but also fall is upon us and the fall art is bomb. So we'll see how this ends up sticking. But we've got the sunset kit from SPC. This is from last year and I think it's just gorgeous. I also think, I don't know, for some reason, kits with these beautiful sunsets really give me um, summer to fall transition vibes. I think it's because like the sun is setting on summer. So anyways, uh, full boxes here. I have the extra color, which I actually really like. The extra fashion, which this is a baddie right here. Definitely a baddie. Um, I think these were just extra skin tone freebies. Then we have the deco page, the glitter header page. I think the colors are super fun on this too. So I think it lends itself to a lot of foil combos, which is both great and terrible for me <laughs> for obvious reasons. We have the little things page, the solids, the patterns, and then the bottom washi date cover page. So I feel like I can go lots of ways for foil. I'm debating doing a lavender moment because I think it'll look super cute with these colors, but I also have these Monstera underlay underlays from Kristen, Kristen's Planner Co. in um, like a teal almost. And I think it's a pretty close match. It's not identical, but I think it's a pretty close match to what she's got going on here anyway. So might do this. So I have a sparkly champagne lights foil pulled. I did do a poll because I've been having the hardest time figuring out foil for this one. And a lot of people thought hollow. I got lavender hollow, which I think could definitely work actually could definitely work um lavender hollow i got regular hollow and gold hollow as option so i mean this is pretty close to gold hollow it's just sparkly honestly but yeah i don't know we'll see what i end up doing and if i end up using it 
it's kind of, I feel like this one is the most shaky for me because of the foil, but also it's also the older one of the ones I have, I think. This is the oldest one, so I kind of want to use it up. So we'll see what ends up happening. That's what I have so far for August 21st. I'm, okay, for the week of August 28th, and this is the one that probably is not going to move, I'm using Freaky Friday from SPC. I just... This movie is a classic for me. I watched it so many times. I love it so much. I think it's so great. The music in it is phenomenal, <laughs> which you wouldn't think, but it is. I love, like, I have such memories of singing that song that they sang in the big, what is it, like, the big, like, rock thing, rock, con it's not a concert. What, what's the word I'm thinking of? Um, crap. I can't think of the word, but you guys know what I mean. I love it. So I love, I love the kit. I love the colors. I think the art is spot on. I'm just obsessed in this. It definitely gives fall vibes. Definitely kind of good for back to school. This is when I'm going to be kind of full fledged back in the office. So I thought it would be good. We have orientation this week, which is, you know, all the back to school vibes. And I just think it's so stinking cute. I'm pretty sure I'm going to do black with this baby. Um, the only other thing I'm considering is SPC just released like a burgundy almost, orangey burgundy foil that I think might match some of the burgundy in the kit, so I might pull that in. But I, for now, am going with black. I actually have the, but I have these, are they the Moo underlays? Yes, the Moo underlays are from Plan With Me stickers. I got two of those just in black because I think that'll look cute. And then I just have just black stuff that I pulled from like a la carte SPC stuff. So I have the black bougie, I have the black bottom washi strips. And I realize again that I do not have headers, <laughs> which isn't the end of the world. Like I don't, like I'm okay if the spread doesn't have headers over the glitter headers. So it's not that big of a deal, but it's funny. I'm like, why am I not prepared? But that is what I'm using for August 28th. I would say this one is probably the most for sure one of all the ones you guys have seen. So now, finally, we're just going to do our honorable mention, which I'm really torn, of course, because this isn't really summer, but it kind of really is summer. So <laughs> I don't know, basically, but let's make sure I have I think this was called Agrabah from Glam Planner. Jasmine is probably tied for my top favorite. One or two. She's always kind of one or two and it kind of moves around. But she's she's up there as far as my favorite princesses go. I think she is just stunning. This fashion girl. It's gorgeous. Look at Raja. Like, it's just amazing. Um, we have the heart checklist page. Abu, Aladdin. I just think it's so cute. You have your functionals and I really want to use it up and I'm hoping that I have glitter headers. I think I did get glitter headers for it. I'll have to look through my stack. Um, we have a little bit of deco carpet. Oh, so cute. Scripts, more kind of labels and washi, um, more boxes, icons, and then your bottom washi, which I'm not really a fan of the bottom washi, like all together. It doesn't really do it for me, but we have that. And then let me make sure I have glitter. Oh, okay, good. I have extras. I'm like, oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> we have the double box scene here. So pretty glitter headers. Thank the Jesus Christ. And then I did pick up some extra labels and boxes just cause this is not a format I'm kind of used to. I don't use a lot of glam planner kits. Um, so I did pick up the two label add-ons. I have the big box of Raja, which like, how can I make it so that I can get like basically all of Raja? I'm not sure, but I'm going to try my best to cut it into a tall box. I have the also big tall or, you know, the big, big box of the like spa area. Oh, the throne. It looks like the throne. I'm not sure, but it's so cute. And I got this and I'm not sure why I got this, but it's like more washy, I guess. Is it like a 15 millimeter? It might be a 15 millimeter. We'll have to see. But that is Agraba. And then I have this, I'm not gonna take it out because you guys, you guys know the drill at this point, but I have this star sparkly orange foil bundle. So cute that I think would look super cute. 
Not sure if I want to pull in more orange or more purple, so another game time decision, but I kind of really want to use this, so I might just have to bite the bullet and sub one of the summer kits so that I can slot this baby in because I think it just, the colors are so August to me. Like, they're so late summer. Late summer, great for a summer to fall transition, the colors in my opinion, so I think it's so fun. So there is that. So. That's my tentative <laughs> planner kit lineup. So we have um, Agraba, which is the honorable mention. We have Freaky Friday from SPC. We have Sunset from SPC. We have the May 2023 Pink Diamond Planner Co. Mystery. And we have Seaside Serenity from Liner Designs. I feel like we have a good mix of shops in this one. Like this is a good mix of shops right here. I think this is like all of them. <laughs> like all of the shops right here in this wild lineup. But, and then I don't think I said this, but diamonds for breakfast from Caress Press. So that's what I'm thinking for August, y'all. Let me know down below if we're twinning, maybe twinning, since things are always subject to change around here. But let me, uh, let me know down below if we are twinning, if you have any foil suggestions of the wildness that I have presented to you all. Thank you so, so much for watching, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see y'all real, real soon. Bye.